Where are you at, Sam? <coughs> Shit. No chance. No hope. Or in other words, England. Oh, you forgot Brexit. <coughs> if you didn't already know, the 2018 World Cup started on Thursday. This video comes out on a Saturday. And what is that supposed to mean? You should subscribe to Bath 14. Where is the correlation there? There's not. Okay. Okay. This isn't going nowhere. It is. Um. Into the shitter. <coughs> I love my life. Yo, what is up, guys? My name is Bass with you. Welcome back to my channel. Today, we are talking England, unfortunately, and how we should line up in our opener against Tunisia. I mean, because we can all agree that Gareth Southgate is a shit manager. No, 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 no. And before this video does start, I want you to go down there, like the video, subscribe to my channel, and shout out to you, and shout out to you. And if you would like a shout out in my next video, <clears throat> just before you say anything, listen, mate, it's the World Cup. So go find your nearest pub, buy yourself a pie of lager. Actually, no, you're not old enough. Buy yourself some Sainsbury's tropical juice. And, um, fuck off. Where was I? And if you would like a shout out in my next video, all you're gonna do is go down there and hashtag Team14 in the comments down below. And while you're in the comments, comment about England. What's your lineup like? Are we gonna beat Tunisia? Are we shit? Fuck Gareth Southgate. <laughs> and with that being said, let's get straight into this. Hey, no interruptions. I like it. <clears throat> Cheers, Jeff. Goalkeeper Jordan Pickford. For me, our number one should be Jordan Pickford. Shout out to man like Joe Hart for being shit. I mean, Pickford had a decent season with Everton. Nothing special, nothing out as well. But I mean, when your other options are Butland and Nick Pope. And when it comes to kicking, I think he is our best goalkeeper and he is our best option when it comes to playing out from the back. Or he could just left Neuer. Simple. Kick over the top and go. <coughs> for explaining my idea. Centre back Harry Maguire. First of all, I have to say I am going for three at the back because that seems to work out very well for Arsenal. <coughs> Must have Mustafi is shit. What? Harry Maguire. He's massive. He's strong. And um, Brexit. <laughs> Centre back. The Rock. Yes, The Rock. Actually, he. It doesn't matter what you think. What really matters is that guy there and his fucking stomach. Oi! John Stone. He's very good. He's probably our best player on the ball. He likes to roll up from the back and he plays for Man City. The more Man City, the better. And the less Arsenal, the better. Agreed. Oh, for fuck's sake. Centre back, Kyle Walker. I mean, Tottenham have the likes of Rose, Ali, and Kane. Some would describe them as world class. I would describe them as retards. Kyle Walker, meanwhile, he has a brain. The guy left Tottenham and won the league. What about the other options? Trip. That never happened. <laughs> Why are you laughing? Oh, I'm just watching your Man City vlog from the cup final. It's good. Kyle Walker, he plays for Man City. That's all I care about, okay? Left wing back. Danny Rose. I can add this one up. I'd like to take this moment out of the video for a quick moment of silence for Danny Rose and his Tottenham career. Oh. oh. Despite having barely played, he's our best left back. He's used to the system and he wants to leave Tottenham, having served his jail sentence there. It's fine, Danny. Better days to come. Hashtag free the nipple. Nipples? Right wing back, Alexandra Arnold. Fresh off winning the Champions League with Lid. Never mind. For me, Alexander Arnold is very technically gifted. When it comes to striking the ball, he has lovely technique, he's a good pass of the ball, and he seems to be under. Any objections? What? What about the other options? Like Trippier? <laughs> Central midfield, Jack Wilshire. <coughs> Fuck Gareth Southgate. <coughs> Central midfield, Jordan Henderson. Do you know what? I might just be a genius, but I think even for me, this is a step too far. So, how about you, man, take over? No. Anyone but you. He's shit. Boring. And they can't. Ooh, personal. I like it. Central midfield, Fabian Zell. He plays for Man City. Let's move on. Bruv, I swear you score Man City now. Well. Left wing, Marcus Rashford. Baller. Believe it or not, I actually like Marcus Rashford. I like the style he has, the technique on the ball. Very Ronaldo esque. For me, he has a lot of potential, and I have nothing bad to say about him. Yeah, that was believable, because trust me, I've been getting too much hit from my nice fans nowadays. Um, Babs. Oh, fuck. Right wing, Raheem Sterling. Now at this point, I want to get really deep and give my true thoughts on the Raheem Sterling situation. Fuck John Cross. And fuck Piers Morgan. Agreed. And fuck Babs 14. Agreed. Wait, what? Recently, there's been a lot of debate between who should start Rashford or Sterling. Why not just play both? They have pace. They are good. They score goals. And Deli Ali's a wanker. <laughs> Striker, Harry Kane. Now, as much as I would like to say Danny Welbeck, I just... Welbeck! Fuck it. Striker, Danny Welbeck. Where are you at, Sam? <coughs> so, with that being said, guys, that is it. If you enjoyed the video, smash a like on it. Subscribe to my channel, Basketball Team, if you are new. Again, I would like to say this video is all about entertainment purposes. Don't look it personal. Also, don't forget to comment down below your opinions on the video. And hashtag Team 14 if you like a shower. And, I mean, while you're in the comments, you might as well also talk about England. What you line up like. How good are we going to do this World Cup? Who's going to win the World Cup? Basketball Team's great. I know. And with that being said, guys, Basketball Team, the World Cup is here. And I've got so much stuff planned. Obviously, because your boy is a massive liar. 
ding 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 